Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Abila Aisha Damnila Fondi Kodnana. And if this is your first time, don't forget to subscribe and also join the family. Well, my previous video, I made a food vlog where I was talking about preparing beans without the use of palm oil. Ibiki, have you seen that video? Yeah, I did. Okay. Um, well, I have a guest here with me and some people might know her. She might be looking familiar to some persons and some might not know her. Her name is, her nickname is ABK and she's the... SU, the Students' Union Vice President for University of Illinois. So, if you can, can you please introduce yourself to the audience? Good day, everyone. I am Abreza Kauthar Adi, popularly known as ABK, Student Union Vice President of University of Illinois, permanent site. Oh, I yeah, am, that's true. Okay. We have to. Yes, exactly, exactly. I'm also an entrepreneur. I'm the CEO of ABK Concept and ABK Farms. Thank hmm. you very much. <laughs> everything. You're doing everything together. <laughs> oh, I want to ask you okay. how do you balance? stuff and these other responsibilities because before we could fix today ah, I had to reschedule and reschedule okay, try because, she's try because she's actually very very busy so how do you balance everything together you know nothing is in life is easy but with God everything has been made possible you understand but I think the major way I've been able to do is for the past more than almost five years now the way i've been able to do it is the way i schedule my time i use most of my times on things that are productive and things that will add value to my life for my business my academics and every other thing that i'm involved in currently i'm the vice president and you know i have a lot of activity being yeah. the vice president you have to attend programs yeah, you have events. to attend events meetings yeah. and every other thing but before i leave home in the morning i make sure i schedule my activity to be able to know okay so so, so, so time i will have to do this so, so, so time i will have to do this so that's why, how i've been able to do it for almost five years now wow. and i think it has been going on well smoothly compared to when i don't even have other engagements apart from yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Now. And she's a scholar, so she's very intelligent. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, we had this program in school, um, Students' Union Empowerment Scheme. So I want to ask you, was it better out for your passion of entrepreneurship that this um, program was held, or is it that it was part of your manifesto when you were going for the post? Before going into any post in life, even personally, you know, we all have a vision, we all have things we have interest in. Yeah, I think this yeah, is what I have for. interest in. Even before I became the vice president of students, you know, this is what I've done for students in my faculty also wow. when I was the vice president of my faculty. I believe this is just what I have passion for. That Even after school, I, have, I will still keep continue doing. doing, you understand? So it's part of my passion. And also I made a campaign promise and I was able to fulfill it. So that was the major reason why I had to organize this. And I'm so happy a lot of students benefited from this yeah, scheme. I'm so happy, yes, a lot of students benefited from Thank okay, you. let's chip this in. ABK, what do you do for fun? How do you have fun? Do you go to clubs? Like, do you go to, like, no, now? Yeah. That's also part of it. You know, there's something a lot of people don't understand. I'm still like a normal student. I, yeah. I have fun the way I'm supposed to. The okay. same, I, I even sometimes, you know, personally, I have fun more than people that are not doing any other thing. Do you, because I know the way I schedule my time. I swim. Personally, I swim. Hmm. I go out. I go I to events. I attend weddings. Really? <laughs> they have to pay me for that because I paid to train also. Okay. Yeah, I'm also a professional swimmer. Like I used wow. to be part of the school team before I got too engaged. But for now, I just swim for fun. I used to be part of the team wow. for stu um, student team before. Okay. So, you know, I have fun. I do every other thing. I swim. Mm -hmm. I read books apart from school books. I go out. So I think that's where I spend you my day. And too. I still sleep. I think sleeping is another <laughs> thing. So, you know, I go through a lot of stress. And the only reason why I can recover most of it because I don't take drugs. So the only way I'm able to recover the lost energy is through sleeping. Yeah. You understand? So by the time I get up, I sleep refreshed. You know, I feel refreshed each yeah. time I sleep. And I go out, swim, and every other thing. So I'm just okay. like a normal student. So there's nothing okay. you get. So. All right. Well, you have um, your your own business, ABK Global Concept. Am I correct with the name? Mm, yeah, ABK Global Concept. We, we are going global okay. very soon. Yeah. yeah. So, so, do you have a team you work with, and how do you get your ideas, and how have you been able to keep up with it with politics? Mm, this is the way it is. I started graphic. I'm a graphic designer. I'm into graphic designing. I'm into printing work. I started this when I was in hundred level. Okay. Before I get admission into this university, I used to feel like I wanted to have a first class, and that was yeah. I didn't have any Scholar. money, anything. So first class. So immediately I gained admission. I learned this work, graphic designing, before I gained admission, okay. and I used to work with a company then wow. again before I gained admission. But when I gained admission, I already felt I can't do anything again because no, I want to have class. first class. You Scholar. understand? Yeah. So, but I think luckily for me, second semester, 
when I was in hundred level, I met someone and I discussed this is what I can do, this is what he was like, ah, no, you can't do it. That's why the fact that you're a student, you can still do Balance your together. business. And then immediately he advised me to start up something. I started meeting people, okay, to tell them this is what I do. I can design this for you. I made a business card for myself. I started meeting people. I started meeting students and some like officials in this school like okay escorts across all faculties this is what i do and they started patronizing me they were really impressed uh, wow, wow you're doing this and understand and i must tell you despite the fact that when when my first semester results came out i did do well in second semester that i was doing compared. business compared to when wow, i was in first semester wow, and do you know how i was able to do this when i was in during the first semester i used to feel like I still have time to read. I still have time to read. But when I was working, I feel like so so time you have to meet up. It must not because of your business, business feel. Yeah. I don't want anybody to talk to me at home. You understand? Yeah. So I feel like I have to just make sure I show them I can do this thing. Yeah. So I just had to put in more effort. I used to like schedule my time and every other thing, and it was. So it's actually modern. very important to meet with persons that can motivate you. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah we need people that, that would motivate us. Because I've told someone who might discourage you. Yes, that I just face you. Okay, so balancing business and politics, or let me say business and politics, do you think those two things are related? Because I feel like they are sort of different, like they are two different things. Mm, they are two different things, fine. Uh, for you to be a politician, you need to campaign, you need to do all sorts of things. But I must tell you, there are a lot of things you do in politics that really help you in business. Mm. Like, you know, for you to contest for a particular office, you need to convince people, you need That's to talk to people, you have to you understand a yeah. lot of things. So, you know, all those things, if you really learn a lot, you know, understand, you have to be able to manage people because you, you'll be meeting people from different, different person, yeah. people with different perspectives, people with, with different personalities. I and I must tell you, before you, like, your involvement in politics would even help you more in your business, business because you already learned a lot of things, you already you meet new people and from there you can to... grow more in your business. So it really work hand in hand. Both okay. of them work hand in hand. Okay. Yeah. So Ibiki, hmm, let me ask you this very funny question. Okay. If marriage should come in now, like okay, ah. wedding bill, pam pam pam, everybody's buying the Ankara. <laughs> Do you think it's going to be affecting your career positively or negatively? Do you think it's going ah. to be there will be something you might not be able to do again because of the marriage thing? Okay. <laughs> it's actually a very <laughs> you know, I think one thing in life is that whether whether I get married now whether I get married later, I'll still have to get married. Yeah. Do you get my point? But I think one thing I have to consider is that the kind of partner I would get married, be, get married yeah. to. So it doesn't depend whether it is now, whether it's... I can get married now if it's... If I, it's it's it to help you. No, so far you have someone that keys into your goal, you understand? Just have to have a partner that has the same, like, you, you'll be able to reason yeah. along. It would even help more because you have someone to always... To with, see things you together this is what with is you. going on this yeah. is you understand and so you. and it believes in you it'll be able to help you more even in any of your chosen career so it doesn't in any way it cannot in any way affect any of the things that that depends on the partner okay and, and that's i pray to get a good partner you know sure. so okay i didn't name that you're looking for looking at me okay okay no, she's no. not disclosing that but then I pray she gets a good partner so the partner will be able to see and believe in our dreams and also help yeah, yes. help us. Okay, let me not say only you. <laughs> me too. I need someone who would okay not tell me that oh Aisha, I'm not doing this blogging and everything. No. You cannot just come and stop my passion like that. So uh -huh, we need no. to, to get married to someone who believes in our yeah, dreams, exactly. who sees what we want to do and appreciates us and also wants to help us grow. Yeah. If you kid and lots of persons that look up to you, lots of young persons. I look up to you too. Mm -hmm, thank so you. they might be like ah, how does she do all these things? Like it's actually very, very like it's complicated. You do everything together. What do you want to tell people that are looking up to you? Do you think are you going to be giving them advice? That, no, don't do it oh Ah, what I'm going through now. You know, some people tell you, don't come to you learn the stress they can kill, all those kind of things. So are you going to be encouraging them that you should try, you should give it a try, you can do it? Yeah, I you know, one thing I believe in life is that once you have you have to know where you're going. By knowing where you are going, you'll be able to walk towards Horses. it, you understand? So there's nothing stopping you to, for you, like, if you have a big dream, there's nothing stopping you from achieving it, if you really believe it. Yeah. When I wanted to do the empowerment scheme, I, it was not sponsored by anybody, like, I didn't have, Any not sponsors. from the, okay. yes, not from the, the unions, account. unions account, you understand? So, but I believed, it was when I was asked, how would you be able to, I believe it is possible, I can achieve this, you understand, and it was possible because I believe it. So everybody should just, once you have the mindset that this is what I want to achieve, 
in the next three months i already have a goal i've set aside for myself okay in the next three months this is what i want to have in the next three months this is what i want to achieve this is where i want to be so you just have to have okay have a vision this is where you want to go you'll be able to work to, there's nothing stopping you from doing anything you want to achieve no matter how big it is it depends depends on your mind things. and if you work towards it and make so, sure you remain focused if you so that's the only way next vp VPs so just work towards you can work achieve it. it nothing is impossible, impossible. You understand? so that's Thank how it you. works yeah. so what do you want to tell our viewers <laughs> that are watching okay. what's, your, what's your final note for those are not those students okay to anybody okay to so everybody out there first of all i would like to tell them to subscribe to our youtube channel <laughs> thank you please <laughs> so i think that's a major thing subscribe to our youtube <laughs> channel you'll get uh, you'll be able to gain a lot of things on our channel you'll be able to so to everyone out there thank you very much for listening all right thank you so much for watching i hope abk was able to inspire and maybe impact in you in a way don't forget to subscribe like comment and you can also follow our on our social media platform please okay so you can me follow know. me i have my business pages i have my personal account okay on instagram my personal account is adeyi kausara okay. a-d-e-y-i-k-a-o-s-a-r-a-h for my personal account okay. on linkedin abdreza kausara adeyi okay. on linkedin on twitter uh, my personal account is adeyi kausara the same a-d-e-y-i K A U S A R H. Okay. For my business, I have two business accounts. I have ABK Concepts and I have ABK Farms. So ABK mm. A B K underscore C O N C E P T for the graphics and printing work. But for the farm, ABK underscore F A R M S. So I can come and get free um, poultry food now. Like, no, I'm not into poultry. I'm into beekeeping. I keep bees and I'm into fish farming. So that's okay. what I do majorly for now. But you know, as time goes on, you diversify. You get so. But you need to start somewhere before you now say, okay, this is where I want to go. Also, you now before you expand and, more. Yeah. So business. if you need honey, honey, give yes, us. I produce honey. Okay. And then catfish too. Yes. You can get that for free. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Right. See you next time. Bye bye. Thank you.